Brainy Dose presents 10 Reasons Why People Are Staring At You Do you ever feel like all eyes are on you, even when you're just minding your own business? It could be on the street, in a meeting, or at a party. Being the subject of someone's intense gaze can be uncomfortable, to say the least. But have you ever stopped to wonder why people are staring at you? From the subtle signals you're sending to the subconscious biases of those around you, there are a multitude of reasons why you might be the center of attention, and some of them might surprise you. Here are some common situations where people might stare at you. Number one, your face looks familiar to them. Sometimes people might be staring at you simply because they think they recognize you. Your face might look familiar to them, and they're trying to figure out where they know you from. We're constantly exposed to images of other people, whether it's on social media, billboards, or magazines. And when we see someone who looks familiar, our brains automatically search for connections to those images. It's nothing to worry about, and it's actually kind of flattering if you think about it. Maybe you have a distinct look that people find memorable. Number two, you're drawing attention to yourself. Maybe you don't realize it, but you may be drawing attention to yourself by doing something unexpected or out of the ordinary. Whether you're acting strangely, doing something embarrassing, or making an impression on strangers who don't know what to make of it, you're definitely attracting attention. Let's face it, people are naturally curious, and if they see someone doing something that's not the norm, they're going to look. Number three, you stand out from the crowd. Another reason people might be staring at you is because there's something different about your appearance. If you have a unique hairstyle or piercing, it might be attracting attention. Maybe you're really, really tall, or people notice a scar on your face and wonder how it happened. Perhaps it's your clothing. If it's unusual or unique somehow, people may take notice of it as well. Number four, you have a confident aura about you. When you're confident, you project an energy that's hard to ignore. You walk with purpose, speak with conviction, and radiate positivity. When you exude an air of self-assuredness, others are naturally drawn to you, be it out of disbelief, jealousy, or appreciation. People can't help but feed off that energy. They want to know your secret. They want to know what you have that they don't. Number five, they are daydreaming. Daydreaming is a common occurrence. Our minds can wander off into different thoughts and scenarios, and sometimes we can get lost in our own world. When this happens, we may not even realize where we are looking or what we are staring at. It's possible that when someone is staring at you, they're actually lost in their own thoughts and are not intentionally trying to make you uncomfortable. You just happen to be in their line of sight as they drift off into their own world. Number six, they find you attractive. What if I told you that the reason people stare at you is because you're actually more attractive than you think? More often than not, we tend to underestimate our appearance. We can be our own worst critics and not see the beauty that others see in us. Nevertheless, it's natural for people to be drawn to attractive qualities, whether it's a dazzling smile, gorgeous hair, or a captivating personality. So the next time you catch someone's eye, don't be so quick to assume the worst. You might just be turning heads for all the right reasons. Number seven, they're silently judging you. In some cases, people may be staring because they are making a judgment about you. Maybe you are doing something they consider inappropriate or controversial. This could be anything from talking loudly on your phone in a public place to wearing an outfit that doesn't fit with the norms of the environment you're in. Or maybe they've heard things about you. It might be gossip or rumors that have spread throughout your social circle or community. This can be awkward and make you feel self-conscious, but it's important to remember that their opinions and judgments do not define you as a person. Number eight, they're trying to catch your attention. When someone wants to get your attention, they may stare in order to make eye contact with you and get you to notice them. Eye contact is a powerful form of communication that can convey a range of emotions and intentions. By staring, the person is trying to establish a connection with you and signal that they have something important to communicate. It's also possible that they are feeling angry or hostile toward you, or that they are trying to intimidate you in some way. So consider the context and the person's body language when trying to interpret their intentions. Number nine, some people stare unintentionally due to a lack of awareness or social skills. 
Staring can be unsettling and even rude, but it's important to understand that some people may do it unintentionally due to a lack of awareness or social skills. It's common, for example, for individuals on the autism spectrum to have difficulty with nonverbal communication, and they may not realize that staring is considered impolite. Additionally, some people may have a medical condition that makes it difficult for them to control their eye movements. It's best to approach these situations with empathy and understanding and to communicate kindly if the staring is making you uncomfortable. Number 10. It's all in your head. The feeling of being stared at can also be an illusion. Our brains are constantly processing information from our environment, including visual cues. It's common for people to feel self-conscious or anxious in social situations. This can be due to a variety of factors, such as past negative experiences, low self-esteem, or fear of rejection. You may become hyper-aware of your own behavior and how others perceive you, especially when in a new or unfamiliar place. This can lead to a heightened sensitivity to people's behavior toward you, including their gaze. Being stared at is usually harmless, but it can still be intimidating sometimes, whether intentional or not. It's important to remember that there are many reasons why someone might stare at you. Some of these reasons may be flattering, while others may be less so. By understanding the possible reasons behind someone's stare, you can better navigate the situation and respond appropriately. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share with your friends so we can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to click on the notification bell. Also, be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.